Alright, good noon. Welcome to our newest long play. This is Subnautica. Beat back a whole host of contenders, including Oxygen Not Included, to become our next long play. And this is completely blind uh, outside of the first few minutes of the opening to test it out. I've never played this game, nor have I seen anything nor read anything about it. Apart from the fact that it has some subtle horror in it. Who's to say? I do like horror, though. In any case, we're going to start a new game, we're going to do survival. I don't know what the end goal of the game is. I assume get off the planet, but I don't know. We'll play this long play till its logical conclusion. Fit like the day, loon, says Space Lizards, who's trying way too hard. We're doing good today. It's stupid, but I still do love the trope of smash a machine hard enough and it'll work for you. Okay, we're on fire, but we stay cool, calm, and collected. The three C's extinguish the fire in an enclosed area, so we're probably going to end up with a minor case of serious brain damage. And figure out what's going on here. mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice good luck all right nice of the game to immediately show us what we're going to be dealing with inventories thankfully we have a nice large one um, we're going to be able to augment ourselves just like in factorio bunch of stuff to make so i'm also getting astronomy uh, vibes out of this something about a beacon no idea we can take photos, got a voice log, and it told us to check the data bank. Get away from me, uh, screen there. Emergency uh, information about the life pod, fine, not gonna read that. Information about our suit, also fine, still not gonna read that. The Aurora ship, 23 people, ooh. <laughs> there were engineers, lots of them. We can establish our workshop and medical post. Yeah, that place got absolutely brutalized. Uh, if you're reading this, you've survived an emergency evacuation. Yeah, it was pretty good. The hard part is over. We can relax now. Uh, this thing, vital signs, blueprints, camera, cross-compatibility. Sure thing. Administer first aid. Uh, rations, environment. Conduct necessary survival. Oh, construct for the life board. Da -da -da -da. Okay, lots of stuff to do, but I'm sure we'll figure it out ourselves. So, first off, can I put this thing away? Yep. Uh, let's grab that first aid kit, and we probably got a bit banged up, so let's take care of that head trauma. Uh, use repair tool, but I don't seem to have one. There's a fabricator here. I assume this is what we do to make our basic equipment, but we don't have anything to make with. And... Here's our storage container. Flares, water, and food. Not a lot of any of them. I'll take uh, one, one, and one. And we're a bit hungry, so I guess I'm going to consume you straight away. Delicious. About the water? Nah, we'll leave that there. Right. We also need to repair the radio. There's a lot of stuff to suss out, but... Hmm. Power cells. Ah, all looks fine in here. Good thing we didn't get decapitated. The idea of the panels just flying off the side is a bit terrifying. It's a poorly made... Where would that panel even come from? I'm not... I'm not seeing it. Oh well, whatever the case, out we go. 
percussive maintenance isn't actually complete bollocks, Jake. It worked in old TVs because the contacts in the vacuum tubes. Yeah, I, I remember doing that quite a bit. I had to slam my TV to make it work. Zero human life signs detected. Well, sucks to be on board that. Let's go check it out. We're taking a dive. So I assume what I'm going to want to do is scour for materials that have fallen down here, like uh, this vibrating eyeball, and use it to piece together stuff in our inventory system. Like here's a a fragment, but I can't seem to pick it up. Maybe it's not something I meant to pick up. What's that? Trap fragments. Just can't escape traps no matter what game I play. I can see my oxygen heading down and down, so let's go up for air. Goes down in chunks of three, huh? Then we're cutting that fine. I'm really going to want to augment that oxygen if I'm spending so long underwater. Any more for any more. Yeah, my, my old TV had dial on it. I had to dial back and forth to get a good picture. And even if you had it set to something good, it wouldn't stay good. Break limestone, yeah, sure. Picked up some titanium. Now I'm no geologist, I don't know how this stuff works. But I'm not sure I can get functional titanium by just slamming it to uh, the seabed. Right, good to keep my bearings that that's my pod and that's the ship, because even though that looks really simple, Guarantee I'm going to figure out a way to get lost between that. Now that looks way too deep for me to comfortably manage for a while. So why don't we stick close to the surface, peer down, and see if there's anything close by that we can get that'll be useful. Just how old are you, says Space Lizards, that I keep close to my chest. Can we swim all the way through here? Oh wow, that would not be good if you were a claustrophobe. I think I used to be, but uh, I don't have a problem with tight spaces now. Couldn't afford to have a problem with that when I worked in the water industry. We were clamoring around all sorts of tight water. Chew! I don't think these guys like me. Oh, they don't. Oh, they really don't. Sorry for disturbing you. So I only had one first aid kit and I already used it, didn't I? More giant coral tubes. Hmm. Fascinating and all, but I think I need some equipment. You there. Again, it's just fragments and I uh, can't appear to pick those up. Okay, so <laughs> I don't know why, but the, the sea life here swims towards me and explodes and my health bar is already not looking good. Don't know what I can do to fabricate some more health. Okay, I was expecting a bit more by way of debris. Maybe I do have to go closer towards the ship where uh, things look deeper and harder to deal with. I didn't used to have an issue with confined spaces. Had to go through some as a firefighter for some reason. I recently developed an unease with tight spaces like that, says Legendary Marvin. I mean, some tight spaces it is correct to be uneasy about. Ah, that's what I'm talking about. Metal, uh, metal scraps for salvage. Surely there's going to be more of that. Surely. I mean, that looks like more of it, right? Some things we can grab, some things we cannot. And all this stuff I already checked out, so I'm not gonna not gonna fret over that. Oh well. You look like salvage. 
Yoink. Whoa. Sorry to have bothered you. Now I bet that Aurora is further away than it seems right now. And it's got some big, mean looking guy between me and it right now. Not a big fan. I don't know if pressure is going to be a thing in the game. Like, am I going to experience skull splitting uh, pressure down here? Also, I shouldn't go down any more than half of my oxygen's worth. What's the policy on hints and backseating in this game? I. Ah, right. Okay, let's make an effort for that scrap. I don't tend to have much of a. much of an anything with back seating, but the mods have the swords and they tend to really not like it. Then again, you are a mod and you have a sword. So I'd say do what feels natural. Oh boy, oh boy, I do not get a lot of time down here, do I? Come on, the surface is right there. You can do it. Well, that's a little grim. Let's swim back and see what we can do with this salvage. Because going down that deep is not working out well for us. Also, I am so glad it gives me that UI because I would not know where to go. I'd think, okay, opposite of there in general, but that could be anywhere around here for me. This guy's not bad at swimming. Good thing he was wearing his flippers when he went uh, went into the escape pod. Okay, so I got some junk fabricator. Can we do something here? Let's make some basic titanium. And with that, I can make some equipment, eh? Ooh, like an O2 tank. Well, let's just make a whole bunch of titanium. I can't imagine salvage is good for anything but that. Ooh, I could actually make an ingot. I guess that's just for storage, though. Silicon, glass, bleach. How deep does it go? Right, personal equipment. I would really like... Uh, bigger O2 tank. I shouldn't need a fire extinguisher. Don't know about pipes or floating air pumps. Floating device that pumps air into pipes acts as a starting point for a pipe chain. I'm really getting Astronomir um, vibes here then. Waterproof locker storage solution. Well, I like the idea of that O2 tank. A blueprint, you say? Now those were here. That's the stuff that we saw before. Disinfected water needs bleach. Okay, let's drink some bleach. Uh, right, so I'm going to really need to advance if I want that high capacity stuff, but it's, it's good that our O2 has gone up massively now. I need a fiber mesh for a first aid kit. How do I get fiber mesh? No idea, but I've taken a fair bit of banging so far. Fiber mesh, fiber mesh. Good heavens, there's a lot of stuff here. Help me out here. No, it's just the voice log with old news. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. Handheld scanner used to add da 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 yeah, fair enough. Hmm. The health thing does regenerate. What? Oh, I guess it is a fabricator, but what's it fabricating it out of? Perhaps it's best not to know. There we go. I should really see to my water situation, though. 
Let's just dump our titanium here for now. So, for water, filtered water, ingredients unknown. We're surrounded by water, surely. Surely we can figure that out. In any case, let's uh, drink down. Let's drink down. Hope we don't need to go to the bathroom here. I guess the world is one, though. And head back out, even though it's probably very dark. This will be difficult, but whatever. At least I have a lot of oxygen to play with this time. Okay, I can't see a damn thing other than the plants that are lighting up. I don't know if it's meant to be that way, but I have a feeling that this is another case of the game where I'm going to want to increase my monitor brightness for. Uh, I, don't, I don't ever want to admit that I'm wrong. But, uh... I'm certainly not right. Alright, up you go. We'll be daring. We'll go all the way to 35. Okay, now I can kind of see things. Not convinced there is anything inside those little, um, little boxes. I haven't found anything of use in them yet. So breaking apart the wall for titanium, was it titanium? It was something that I got out of the wall, seemed useful, so maybe I should go and, uh, ah, peruse nature. But how do I know where the blocks are that I can break? You look like one. Copper is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just decreased to unlikely, but plausible. <laughs> plausible. My whole life is far from plausible. Any more for any more. They seem to jut out like a sore thumb, so... Come on, it does. It takes a lot less time to swim to a surface. There we go. I'm not excited by the idea of building up an oxygen pipe network if it's anything like Astronomer's uh, power lines. Because those were a pain. Oh, I can pick up fish? You're coming with me. Oh, man. They're all coming with me. What else can I take? Oh, jeez. Harvest the earth. What are you? Silver. <laughs> We're going to get rich here. I'll steal their eggs, steal their silver. Oh, better take a breather. Okay, nobody told me this was a wonderful looting game. Oxygen. Yes, I know oxygen's a thing. Can we use this underwater? Oh, we can! Cool, let's go up! Now let's see what we can do with the uh, with a fish. Turn him into fish paste ration? Not my first choice, but I don't get first choice here. Okay, Fabricator, what can you do with this fish? Yeah! It is common for those accustomed to synthetic foods to be repulsed by eating an animal carcass. Remember that humans survived this way for millennia. You can too. Can I now? I need salt in order to cure it. But, uh, does this food go off after a while or not? Right, I can make myself some glass. And battery and copper. Oh, copper wire. <laughs> Gotta get that uh, one to two ratio, right? 
How do I make my green circuits? Okay, fascinating. And I do mean that, but... What about all these... Acidic flesh, acid mushrooms? I don't know what to do with all you, but the obvious thing is just to slam you into my container. Which probably has limited space here, so maybe I should make these titanium things into ingots. Save myself some space. Handy, probably. It's just the standard one, the extinguisher, the pipe, and the floating air pump. Not so sure about those. This might be useful. We'll, we'll make one just in case. Where where is that uh, that thing that I just cooked up? Old cooked Gary fish actually gives me some water as well. Floral flavor, but very little of it. Chomp it down. Wow, I can consume them as they are. Edible fish, high calorie count. Well, let's cook one up and see what happens. disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Nay too shabby. Oh wow, we are satiated. How high does our food meter go? Okay, that's as high as it goes. We're getting a bit chubby out here, so we need to go and swim to lose some weight. Got an unidentified egg. I'm going to hold on to that for sure. And I guess we can shove our ingots in here for a bit. And I guess the glass. It's a shame that it doesn't use the inventory for the fabricator, but what you gonna do? Well, I'm gonna keep this and then go out and pillage some more. Will you play until you win or play until you die? I'm, I'm here to win. Got no intention of dying. But I do need to find more of those rocks to slam with my bare fist to get the resources out of. Painful thing is, there's going to be people that notice them in chat, and I won't, and then they'll go, Oh, Jake, how are you so blind that you couldn't see XYZ? It's, like, it's just how it works. Yeah, you've got 290 pairs of eyes. It's assuming everybody watching has two eyes right now. I've only got two, and whilst they are augmented, they're also hampered by a poor perception stat. So I didn't see diddly there, but there's plenty more to check out. Does this game have a permadeath mode and does Jake use it? Yes, it has permadeath. No, I'm not permadeath. Thanks. I've never played this before. I don't want to go through the whole... Uh, intro rigmarole again, just because I died to something that I didn't know was a threat. Because I don't know much about this game. Okay, I think we have enough acid mushrooms for a lifetime right now. Not seeing a lot of stuff to steal right now, though. I had better luck going through their homes. You're coming with me, though. I'm hungry. Oh, well, I see you. I'll be coming for you. Alright, let's go get it. Looks like winter from here. Oh god, winter will be up on us soon. I was meant to get away for that, from that. Okay, come with me. Did I actually grab that? Yes, yes I did, probably. Coral tubes, a brain coral. Some kind of egg. Definitely stealing that. Perhaps I can enslave these beings to do my bidding.
come with me. And I'm gonna call it the boomerang. <laughs> Steal the quartz. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Greed is good. What is that floating thing? Ah. Fascinating. So the floaters allowed you to float. So if I attach floaters to something heavy that I want brought up, I'll be able to uh, deal with it up top where it's nice and full of oxygen. Also, gotta hand it to our luck at landing somewhere that has oxygen in the atmosphere. I don't know how that how rare that is out in space, but I'm guessing not entirely common. Alright, floaters, you're coming with me. Every last one of you. You look handy. Can I crush myself under this thing? Maybe it's not worth the risk. But I also kind of really want to know. Come on, where are the goodies at? Yeah, I agree. We should go and try some grilled boomerang. It looks so unhappy. Don't worry, you're about to become part of something bigger than yourself. Again, still can't cure stuff here. Can make more glass, though. I assume that's the best use for quartz. What I really already want, though, is that bigger uh, oxygen tank. We have the glass and titanium and the standard thing. Don't I have silver ore? I'm certain I picked that stuff up. Maybe I imagined picking up that silver. Yeah, I was picking up quartz instead of silver. Hmm. Jake, who made you play this game? Made me. This is a long play. It got voted on. Like they all do. Cooked boomerang. I'll just eat that here and now. Shove those eggs away. Maybe it's good to carry this stuff on me so that I can always see what I can make. Also, that is one big egg. So if I want to make this, I need silver. Wait, wasn't I meant to make a repair pack to fix this place up? What's what's going on with that? Scanner, repair tool, needs sulfur and silicone rubber. Flashlight seems handy. I need a battery for that. Oh, and I could make that with some acid mushrooms, which I have. Again, why I can't just use my storage container on this, I don't know, because going back and forth is a pain. But there's our battery, which will allow us to make a flashlight. Yeah. Battery pot. Hopefully it doesn't need new batteries all the time. Maybe I should make some of this. It might unlock some new, uh, new blueprints and stuff as I make these. Or it might not. Yeah, okay, used up too much of that. Need to un-ingot it. If such a thing can even be done. Maybe not. 
Jake, I'll hit you up with a mod that allows the fabricator to pull from the storage. Ah, uh, yeah. That would be much appreciated. But I'll grab that afterwards. Okay, perhaps ingoting this was not the best idea, because now I can't use it for stuff. Got a whole load of pipes and other crap like that. Hey, can I put this on my... on my anything here? Oh, it does have a charge. Yeah. Ah, but I use it on my things down here. Interesting. Very interesting. A wig of the pipes. Don't want to use those right now. And we're filling up our blueprints. Roger that. Don't care about voice logs. Data, though. Alien eggs. Substantial number, if not all, of the data. Why don't I crack them open and have an omelette, then? It is impossible to calculate the species of egg from the exterior. Maybe possible to simulate hatching. Don't I want to survive this place? Not, uh... Not go on a little bit of a... Ah, oh, bollocks. I didn't want to use it there. I wanted to transfer it over. Probably couldn't because this is full, though. Um... Well, then. Out we go. So I can have you on if I... Now, don't point at your face. That's how you end up like me. Perhaps I was a bit hasty in upping the brightness then. This is plenty bright. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Smack it with the light! I must be real confident in that fabricator's abilities. 30 seconds. Oh, right click to turn it off. Well, that's handy. Save myself some, uh, some power here. I need silver, though. I don't know where I'm gonna find silver. But I really do want it. Because the longer I can spend underground, the better. Underground? Yeah, let's go with that. Pretty cool music here. They tend to be goodies when I go and uh, pilfer their homes, and I will do exactly that. But I should most certainly go and get some oxygen first. So that's what I mean, going up and down is a pain, so I really need that. I really want that silver. Also, I haven't figured out a way to uh, to get some more water other than eating the plant, uh, eating the... Eating the fishies here. Continued degradation of the auroras. Drive cool. May result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. Now don't give me information I can't action on here. That's just useless. It's called being Max. Grab that ore. Shouldn't need this. Silver-based wiring. It's an essential component of many habitat modules. Detecting sulfur deposits in the local cave systems. Sulfur is an essential component of the repair tool. 30 seconds. Oh shoot, I am not in a good place to be low on oxygen. Up we go, go! There we go. Right, that silver should help us out in a big way. Surfer Reza says, ha ha, oh dead. Pfft, don't count me out that early. I can swim. Let's 
born and raised on an island. Everyone in Britain can swim. I see. There's the count. Uh, the count up for making a new one. Right, fabricator. You and I have unfinished business. Or so I thought, but I lack that titanium, don't I? Yeah, because I turned it all into an ingot, thinking that that would uh, just condense it. Huh. And I'm not sure there's a way to uncondense it. Hmm. How long until he notices the other hatch? Probably quite a while, because I haven't noticed... Oh, Christ, those... Power cells are going down, aren't they? Ho oh, hum. Oh well, let's make more copper wire. Default gain does not allow you to reverse ingots. Then what the heck did I make it for? It said condensed storage. to get more of the stuff. That means finding more scrap. Hmm. Alright, well, enough of that. Exit escape pod. Huh? Ooh. So we got a way in and out from the bottom. Well, that's all fun and games, but I'm gonna need to... How do I just put away all this stuff? I'm guessing that's it all put away. Scrap! I need some scrap. That's a locker, though. What does he need for the bigger oxygen tank? I just need titanium, and I condensed all mine into an ingot which now appears to have been a fool's choice. Ah, see, there we go. We're not even 40 minutes in and Max can't help himself but to backseat. Poor guy. Must be a real problem. Anyway, found a veritable treasure trove of equipment here. I need equipment to mine out that salt, but if I do that, then I can get some cured stuff. Oh, yeah, why don't I just attach floaters to them? I think I saw you in Stellaris. Alright, do I still have those floaters on me? Maybe I threw them all away. Well, very soon I'll have what I need to go diving for much longer. So let's not worry about it. Let's maybe slightly worry about the lack of water, though. It's a fragment. That's a whatever it is. Come on, where's the general purpose scrap? Oh, a bit of salt, though. 30 seconds. Come to me. If you want more O2, you can just carry a second tank with you. Yeah, but making tanks also need titanium. Which we have struggled with now. Yeah, screw it. I don't like going up and down all the time. Let's make our bigger tank so I can actually spend some reasonable time there. Is 
So about 200 meters away towards the Aurora's... Mm, let's say that point. Is a nice little treasure trove. Working on it. God knows how that works, but it works. Okay, I want me that high capacity thing. Oh, but I don't have a standard O2 tank. Yes, I do. I'm, I'm wearing it. In any case, let's get ourselves that titanium. Right, so I have to make another one? Surely not. Surely what I can do is take it off and then do this. Oh, baby, that's good. Do we have anything else to consider here? Maybe I, maybe no. I didn't grab those fish to uh, to eat, did I? I got uh, I got way too much stuff taking up space here. How about we actually carry some floaters on us? And don't know what else. Let's go and catch some fish so we can hold on. What do I need to make water? Sustenance, water. Unknown and bleach. Well, that's not that's not very good. Down we go. That's right. There was some good stuff over in that direction, 200 meters. But I'm really hungry and thirsty, so let's just grab some fish to uh, to fry up first. But we are the alien. Oh, I think I saw a whole school of fish over there. I bet it could have been my under... Can I grab you and take you home? No, that, that doesn't look healthy for me. Let's uh, seek cover and grab some titanium. I'll grab lots of stuff and the fish of. No, no, we don't want the fish this time. It's not like I'm full here. This is nice. I can actually relax down here a bit instead of... Immediately? Come on now! I'll seek this creature egg immediately. There we go. I'm going to roast ourselves up a seafood platter. Oh, what about this little one? Mm. Yeah, looked all skin and bones, wouldn't satiate us. Couldn't you scan with your tool for stuff and get to know it? I don't have a scanning tool. Besides, this is how we should really get to know something. I imagine bladder fish are full of water. Spongy and grisly.
There we go. And chomp it down. Not a lot of water in these things. Vital signs stabilizing. Of course they are. Now. Hmm, filtered water. If I used the bladder fish, I could make some. Non vegetarian. Ah! Alright, but I still want to uh, chow down a bit. Wonderful. Now I can cure some stuff since I have the salt deposits, but food has not been an issue for some time. A rebreather conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles wiring kit fiber mesh needed. Okay. Air bladder needs silicone, but I certainly don't have that. So some things do require copper ore, so I shouldn't quickly smelt it all into uh, into stuff like that. But what else am I really looking for? What's the next big step up? Repair tool would be nice, but I don't have access to rubber. I was told about sulfur, but I've already forgotten where it is. More batteries. High capacity needs battery. Yeah, lots of things seem to need silicone. You know what, that doesn't seem too bad. Let's have a backup battery. I like the idea of the backup. Switch that over. Hmm. The lack of space here is already feeling a bit rough, but oh well. Any more for any more. Scanner used to acquire technology blueprints on living organisms. Sure, why not? The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to accord alien biological data. Mm hmm. All right. So far, so okay. Aside from the lack of water, but I just need to go and get ourselves a new bladder. Hauling all this stuff around is a real pain. Just want to shove it all in here, but there's not the space. Maybe I have too many of these acid mushrooms, right? We can easily pick up more of those. Where's all this junk should just be thrown into here? Right. Bladder fish, get water. What was the bladder fish again? Ah, I'm sure I'll find it. Seek fluid intake. I'm working on it. Are you a bladder fish? No, you're a nettle thing. Signs normal. Continuing to monitor. Mm hmm. So how do I how do I scan oh no, that's not scanning, that's grabbing. Grabbing is not what I want to do right now. Kind of want to get rid of these. Away y'all go. Right click to scan. Ah. Amazing. That said though, getting a bit thirsty. Where were those bladder fish at?
Were you the bladder fish? Yeah. And if there's one, there's bound to be many. We don't want to scan these little things? Okay. Any more for any more on those bladdery fish. Yep. Come to me. Because I'm really thirsty. And really damaged, says Krebs. What are you talking about? My health's almost full. Some people are just so overly dramatic. Right. All the water you can make me. Nice of it to make me the plastic um, bottle as well. Ask a cup of boomerang for good measure. Right, with that. Vital signs stabilizing. Not bad. I should probably hold on to one of these for good measure as well. Excellent. I wish I could wipe my mind to do another blind playthrough. This says Kajunga. But swimming essentially is uniform muscle development. Alright, this all looks pretty good. Next up, I want a repair tool because this whole place seems to be falling apart. Ah, it'll be fine, I'm sure. What am I looking for? Fins. Swim speed. That sounds pretty good. I like that rebreather. Needs a wiring kit. Which needs silver ore. Didn't I find silver ore? It is such a pain that this stuff doesn't count towards that. No, I did find some, but I'm sure I'll already put it to use. Wiring kit for silver ore. Titanium, sulfur, and rubber. I haven't figured out rubber yet. Perhaps you'll tell me about rubber. Gas pod, don't care. Bladder fish, interesting. Exploitable. Acid. Okay, so there's a lot of stuff to scan, even if I've already picked it up and eaten it. Alright, well, out we go. Ah, oh, okay. Out we don't see a thing. Where was that crashed aurora anyway? Wasn't there some good stuff between here and there? There you are. Again. That's what I came here for, right? It's that poor guy again. Even sounds like he's crying. I'm sure brain corals are nothing new, but... That is some nice music. 
fitting. So I'm meant to scan the garbage that's around here as well. I was hoping I could attach it to these things and lift them up, but instead they just bounce back and hurt me. It's the world for you. I was hoping X, but it just hurt me. Breathe easy. And back we go. Imagine lifting the Aurora using only floaters. I don't see why it wouldn't work. Now, speaking of floaters, let's get to know them. That was a different looking fish. Come back to me, biter. I just want to be your friend. What do we have here? New creature discovered. <laughs> and I get naming rights and eating rights. Okay, the biters go away too fast. Oh, gold! Gold. Seems relevant. It's kind of drowning me in blueprints and stuff that I. Uh... Oh, no, I want that. I'll forget about it if I don't. Oh, oh, hello. And we're fine. Still, though, got some good goodies there. Scanned all this stuff, scanned all that stuff. So are all these things the same every time? Like, if you load up a new game, will all these uh, same things be scattered in the same places? If that's the case, then yeah, I could totally see you wishing you could get rid of your memories of the game and try, uh, try it again from scratch. Ah, oh, I can't take you with me. Take the consolation prize instead. What, I haven't scanned a boomerang fish? I feel like there's going to be a lot of reading to do with all this information we've found. You going to come with me? You're all gonna come with me. All this swimming's building up quite the appetite. Is 
This is quite fun. Well, that's understating it. This is very fun. Lad. A lot of games about exploration can be a real snore fest, but this... This is not. Because the very act of exploring is enjoyable here. Oh, hey Callum. How's it going? The red weed. Let's get full on. Uh... Oh Christ, how can I not remember it? War of the Worlds, that's it. Let's get full on War of the Worlds. <laughs> Cracks me up that we've built this uh, very intricate equipment and we just mash rocks with it. Swole or not, it's hard to do that underwater. Yeah, I think we finally found the game with an underwater level that doesn't suck. Then again, we also found that with Carrion yesterday. Carrion was good. Radiation? Well, that doesn't sound good. Where is it coming from? If I had to guess, I'd say the Aurora. Which feels a whole lot closer now. Well, we found some lead, so I guess we're going to make ourselves some lead plate armor so that we can withstand the radiation. Oh, I can't scan these. What a waste. Gotta be something worth my time in here. Not some crummy photos. Ooh, whoa, I want that sulfur. It's of vital importance. Alright, great. Now I know what I'm looking for when it comes to getting me that, uh, that sulfur. This is just excellent. Eventually I'm going to have to cut the umbilical cord and uh, do some deep diving far away from my beloved pod, but that time is not now. I don't really see the point in placing a locker. I want this stuff back at home base so that I can cook it up. That seems useful. Oh, right, now when I scan them, since I already have the tech, I just get some resources out of them. Very handy. Emergency. A quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state. 
Well, I think we're just going to enjoy watching this. Not every day you get to enjoy watching that. Feels a bit radioactive these days. Seems nice and safe in here, at least. And the power cells are doing A-OK. -okay. So let's uh, patch ourselves up a bit. Much better. And do whatever else. Well, how about some nice water? And, yeah, I mean, I found all this fish. Might as well cook it up. Pungent, smoky, extremely filling. Cooked fish will, uh, will spoil, a live fish will not. I didn't see anything indicating a time until it spoils on these, so I'm sure it's okay. And then again, I'm still a bit hungry. Which is the one that's really filling? Is it the peeper? Yeah. Protein rich eyeballs. Wonderful. Man, I, I need a lot of water. Go figure. Anyway, I found sulfur now at long last. What can we do with you? Table, coral, sample, and copper wire for a computer chip. It's not really what I'm looking for, though. Dehydrating, but keeps well. I don't want more dehydration. Radiation suit needs lead. I have one, but I still haven't found fiber meshes. Hmm. And then there's flares, but I haven't seen any use for those yet. The Sea Glide, battery, lubricant, copper wire. Jeez, ah, loads of stuff that I have not found yet at all. And this place is already pretty dang full. I wonder if I could just deploy this here and now. Use storage containers instead. Are you telling me that I can get more storage containers? What if I just go and slam it there? And what if I attach this to it? Yeah, there we go. There, There's our storage solution. Okay. Not that I know what to do with it right now, but there it is. What to do, what to do. Again, I want to get on the repair tool stuff. But that required, what was it again? Fiber, probably. Fiber meshy stuff. A lot of things need this fiber mesh. And I don't have that. So how do I get it? Perhaps it's high time to check my blueprints. Need rubber. Rubber and titanium. Hmm. You can name this type of locker for better sorting, just so you don't rage in the end for where is what. Ah, uh, we'll let the raging come. Bioreactor. Stores energy. Da 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 da. Nuclear waste disposable. Mm -hmm. But are they not all stuff that's already on this? Wouldn't claim to know. Alright. I want rubber. Don't know how to get rubber. I want radiation suit. I need to find more mesh and I don't know where lead is. Plenty of stuff to do. 
But in the end, I just need to get down there and explore for stuff. But gosh darn, I have too much stuff here. Way too much stuff here. Oh, I see. Decomposing cooked boomerang will now cost me water. Old cooked peeper. Whatever, down it goes. This lack of space is uh, very constricting. Could I just... Yeah, oh no, no, don't eat it. Uh, could I not slam in the fish that I've found here? Of course, they're all cooked now, aren't they? Alright, well, goodbye, cooked fish. Ah, just, just eat them all up, fatty. Drop the ones that cost water, though. I don't know what to make of these eggs. But if I drop it, surely I can then go and scan it. No, no I cannot. Sulfur, gold, titanium, yeah, lots of stuff, but... Make some more titanium out of that uh, salvage. Okay. All right, enough mucking around. Time to think what I'm actually trying to do here. I want fiber mesh, lead, and silicon rubber. None of which I know where to find. And condensing up titanium feels like a trap. So we'll just make sure that it's plentifully deposited here. And these pipes. A chain of pipes can be used to transport breathable air from a functional pump. And I'm, did I ever build a pump? Because maybe I could try that out at that deep area. Equipment, but it's a deployable, right? That would be a no. That would be a yes. What do you need the repair tool for other than the sulfur? Oh, what did I need for it? Uh, come now, repair tool. Where even is that? Silicon rubber is all I need. I've already got the sulfur and the titanium. Okay. Well, out we go. And... Let's try going the other way from the ship. Where's the ship? There you are. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go in this direction. Find somewhere deep, because deep usually means prizes set up the air pod and I didn't bring the pipes did I? Of course I didn't bring the pipes. Deep also means pressure. That's fine. I can I can cope with pressure. No, it's not there. Here's our pipes. At least it's relatively light under here. Do I know about you? I know all about you. What's up with brain corals though? Oh, they let out these bubbles. Can I breathe those? Oh. Oh, that's nice. Oh, this is pretty. A veined nettle. We can learn, but it can't come with us. Mm. 
You don't look like my friend. You do, however, look like a source of sulfur. Wow, the sulfur was so close all along. If there are bladder fish, then I'm certainly going to want those. Smashing our tool against this stuff. Don't know what I picked up there. Perhaps I'll never know. I'm never gonna figure out what that fish is. think the sulfur was so close all along. Right. What did I what did I end up coming back here for or with? I guess a bit of a heal up is a good idea on top of that. Silver, gold, titanium. We got the lead though. The lead is good. Lack of space is really choking, though. Can I just dump the sulfur and copper and stuff? I said I'd fill this with fish, but now I'm thinking it's just going to get filled with some of my materials. And that's right, we have all the bladder fish that I should definitely make into water right now. Wow, this... <laughs> What are we? We're one and a half, one hour ten minutes into this, and the inventory management is already feeling like ah. I should look into any quality of life mods for that. Just something as simple as the fabricator works from all of your um, storage things would be fine and dandy for me. Chow you down, ensure that the water levels are good, and out we go. Because it seemed like, you know, just going three feet in this direction from my ship yielded muckle resource. Is he going to play until the end, says Aquaku. That's the intention. It is a long play, after all. There's no way, no way on earth I'm reading all these entries, though. Some nice surface level stuff, relatively speaking. You used to be able to find surface diamond in Minecraft, is that still the case? There's bound to be people around here that still play Minecraft. Just give it a single mash, seems faster to do it with a tool. Black is saying nope. Maybe in some chests. No, I'm not talking about chests. I'm talking about uh, stuff you mine out of the ground. Salve. Oh, well, this is different. What's your story, big guy? Oh, he doesn't like me. He doesn't seem to like me at all. Life on 
this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. I was never that studious. I do, however, like grabbing all these resources. And also, if you wouldn't mind giving me that air. Okay, well, if not close to the surface, then sure. <laughs> just come here from the start. It's a treasure trove. I got loads of things there. Not necessarily what I need, though. I still need to find... Um, well, I've forgotten, but probably fibery or meshy related things. But those don't seem like things that I'm just going to pick up underwater. Silver, copper, and I already have some lead, but this isn't oh. this isn't everything that I need, sadly. New creature discovered. Ooh. Some weird things going on here though. I don't know what these are, but they look good to me. Can I eat them? They look like they... High silicon and oil content. Ah, well, farewell. No, no it ain't. Get away. Get away, that. That thing's doing something to my mind. Where was it? Never trust anything that wants you to be next to it. Alright, get a bit of a breather, pluck more of those lemons. Because that seems like the key to what uh, what we got to do here now. Although, if I deploy you... I didn't deploy it, did I? How do I how do I actually use this thing? Oh, maybe that is how it's working. And then if I have my pipes. That's not at all working the way I want it to. Ah, okay. I guess. Okay, so how do I just breathe here? Whoa, now. Keep your distance, friend. Right, so just by being next to it, I can enjoy the wonderful air. Oh, it's just being friendly. That's cute. A lot of fish are nice and friendly. Mobile vehicle. That's what we're on about. Also, let's steal more of these. 
Oh, they're big, aren't they? They are damn big. Right, well, goodbye a couple of floaters. Hello, creepy vine. Seems to be about as good as I can get here for now. Stalker tooth. I want that. What? Uh. Christ, that's one way to get a stalker tooth. I bet I want that. What, what, what am I ditching for it? Uh, just gonna eat this fish here and now. And get that tooth. Okay, this is getting a bit painful. Away we go, go. Still, this place is great. What a treasure trove. And it's 250 meters away from our pod. This guy f swims very fast. I think he swims faster than some people can run. That's not how you swim, says Jagger. What do you know? This is the guy that can swim outrageously fast. Right, we got a lot out of that. Let's try not to waste it too much. I know I need lubricant. I also know that I need silicon rubber. Let's make both. Lubricant is essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. I'm going to be making a power plant? I'd like some fins, that's for sure, but let's not get too distracted. I need my repair pack. Ah, this is going to be really painful. Now I need to go through all my storage things to... Okay, where's that mod that just lets you uh, use stuff from your storage for this? Because I'm already outraged at uh, having to go back and forth for this. That is not quality of life. Standard survival tool. Yeah, I'm going to need a knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Braxis Prime. The knife remains the only exception. It's because a knife is a tool, not a weapon. Don't worry, sandbagging is part of the plan, right? What's sandbagging? There's a mod for that, but I don't know the name. Okay, well, at the end of this stream and before the start of the next one of this, I'm getting that mod because... Going back and forth between these for my resources is going to be a whole heap of ass. And then remembering where everything is. Oh, God. Mods and... Ah, thanks, Zergle. I won't grab it now, but I'll grab it, uh, grab it for the next stream. For now, I'll just suffer. Suffer like G did. Right. Let's get repairing. Also, let's repair ourselves. So, what needs fixing? Okay, so we just need to hold out for 99999 hours. 24 hours in a day. Okay, we're just going to be here for a few years. I mean, that's fine. There's plenty of food to be had. Data bank. 
Ah, oh, this whole place feels a lot more livable now. Excellent. Anything else to repair, or did I just make myself a fancy but useless gun here? Hmm. Waterborne bacteria levels high. Is that a good thing? I'm gonna assume so. Oh well, let's get augmenting. Personally, I like the look of those fins, so I need to get more of that rubbery stuff. And I can make yet more of it. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. <laughs> of course it can. There's always a way. What else am I looking for? I wanted a rebreather, but fiber mesh is still out of the question for now. Emergency flotation device. Lighter than air gas for fast personal buoyancy. Is that a one-off item? Because it would be nice to very quickly get to the surface, that's for sure. Yeah, we want to go to our repair tool there. I need a bladder fish. I'm not sure if I kept one uh, alive anywhere, but they're not hard to get. We'll just pop out. Say hello to the old floater, which is not a uh, not a nice name for anything to have. All right, here bladderfish. Just one, so I can get my flotation device. Oh, can I start stabbing things? Oh, ho, 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 ho. it's dinner time. Wow, we suck at this. Right, you have no business still being alive. Come to me, dinner. That's your problem. It's all coming out your arse. I'm here for your face. Um, okay, forgive me for expecting that to have some effect. Bah, humbug. Right, let's get back to the old bladder fish. I think we see some there. Very important. Source of flotation, source of water. And most fortunate for me, they light up so I can see them. That is very kind of them. Right, you! I can't believe that hurt me from there. I mean, sure, you'll give me the sulfur, but I want to know about you. You might teach me things that are useful for getting off this planet. Right, you! Jeez. Tough, tough love. Oh. Can we get a camera clip there? Hmm. Maybe it was to do with getting my light out. Anyway, came for what I wanted, which was that um, that bladder fish. Let's get ourselves some water, a flotation device, and go and check out some more. Really, though, I don't know why I can't just make myself a filter. There's so much water here. Yeah. 
It was tool, flotation device. Lovely. Now, do we wear that? No. How do you work, then? Don't know. But I'm sure we'll figure it out. I am a bit peckish, though. Let's have some cooked hoverfish. Consider disguising the flavor of unsavory meats with salt or locally sourced herbs and spices. There we go. Keep ourselves satiated. Don't know why you're worried about the taste, though. I like fish. I like fish quite a lot. Habitat Builder fabricates habitat compartments and appliances from raw materials. Da 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 da. Okay. Right. I want myself that Sea Glide, and I have everything I need for it. Battery and copper wire, though. It's just a question of where did I put everything? That's copper ore, Jake, not copper wire. That, however, is copper wire. And didn't I make a backup battery? Yeah, I'm holding on to it, haven't I? No, I used it. I used it. So I need an acid mushroom, which is next to me. No, that's it, deployable. Just need battery, and all battery needs is acid mushroom. And we're certain we don't have more of them. Quite certain. Well, it's the easiest thing around to get. Yoink. Ah, that should be fine. I have storage, it's just really cumbersome going between them all. I want to find uh, a mod that allows this to pull from all the storage stuff. Like, going around and dealing with these is not fun. I just want to have a big storage chest and chuck everything into it. And since we can craft storage chests, we know the game isn't trying to limit you on space like that. Uh, right, 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 right. What am I looking for now? Well, I'm looking to take my sea glide out for a bit of a, a bit of a fun run. My health isn't looking too hot though. Would you mind uh, fabricating a bit faster, or did I already make one and store it? I did. I thought ahead. There we go. We are feeling satiated. The mods uh, should be great, but I hope they're compatible with old saves. Can't imagine why they wouldn't be, unless it adds new items, and even then. Uh, right, where are you? Here you are. It needs to charge, you say. Come back, come back. All right, how does this work then? I was kind of expecting it to be a bit faster, but uh, maybe we'll find faster things yet. My question is, how do I charge the thing up? Is there, like, a charger that I plug into for it? Hmm. Switch you over. You need to find the battery charger. Yeah, don't I just... This is LifePod 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. 
So I can go and check. Okay, this thing is powering down as we speak. How in the world do I... Uh... Ah, there we go. Battery. Okay, that's... <laughs> what the heck? Previous SAD... Oh, okay. That's a very out-of-place UI for the game. But it's there, so I can still get around to that. Right-click to turn the light off. There we go. Should stop using up all my power now. Right. The question is, what's the next big thing that I want to get or do? Perhaps the better thing is to consider our blueprints here, of which there are a lot. But it's all a bit meaningless if I don't see the end game here. I want the rebreather, but that needs fiber mesh. Quite a few things need fiber mesh, and I haven't sussed that one out yet. I doubt I'm just going to be able to pick up mesh from the ground. So perhaps I need to scan some garbage from the uh, from the ground to figure that one out. Oh well, let's just have some fun with this thing. Okay, when when I'm underground, I really feel that yes, it is faster. That's wonderful. Go and pillage the place for its everything. Can I scan while I'm... No, I can't. I can't scan while I'm doing that. Brain Coral, give me the... Give me the O2, please. Very generous of you. While I'm pillaging the whole place, though, I'm keen to see where that, uh... Oh, wow. Inventory full already? Lead. Oh, I want, oh, I want gold as well. Alright, sorry, junk, but, uh, looks like I don't need... Ah, I'm gonna miss you, copper. But I like gold, and I need lead. Okay, how about this thing? I have not yet tried you. Okay. Not terribly exciting. This thing's more exciting. too much junk here. I need to build more things to store more things. Yeah, it's a bit rubbish, Jake. You're telling me. Right, what's my major problem here? Too much junk. How do I solve that? By building more places to store more junk. Where was the uh, equipment thingamajigger? It's the deployable waterproof locker. Why can't I just build more lockers here? Oh yeah, and I need more titanium. If only I had titanium. Oh wait, I've got it in the droves! Just use it from my inventories. Right. It's gonna make me angry and I should be. But it's pretty maddening. There we go. So are they just going to float around there? Oh, they just maintain where they are. That's kind of cool. Anyway. Just dunk a lot of this stuff because I need space for my everything. I'll use that salvage, though. There we 
we go. The last thing I want to do before I go and check out that escape signal, or distress signal rather, is grab some dinner. Let's get all King Harkinian on the ecosystem here. avoid the nerve gas as well. Right. Man versus nature. Man always wins. That's how we got to where we are. Come on, eat the damn thing. Alright, I'll pick a fight with you instead. Hey, you got my stuff, stalker! It's night time for you soon, stalker. Whoa, not the big fat guy. It looks dead. Rip its teeth out. I I don't I don't understand. It's the point of killing things, so I'm not going to eat them. Oh yeah, that's a thing. What happened to my oxygen warnings? I remember getting those. Now they're gone. Now I've lost what I was looking for. It was surely somewhere around here. Because that thing was carrying some scrap. Was it you? It was you. Oh, it was just some regular salvage though. Nothing fancy. Let's try out this incredibly underwhelming uh, thing that brings us to the top. Okay. Alright, I don't think I got anywhere near as much food as I was wanting there. But I'll make what I can. gonna eat everything. I've never eaten an eyeball. I'd like to try it someday. I'm not too fussy about what it comes from. Just whatever is considered good. Right. Chow it all down. Yum, yum, yum. A bit of water as well. We have some backup for us when we're out there. And a whole bunch more titanium, and in fact, some stuff to make more titanium out of. Now, let's go and check out that distress bacon. Oh, this inventory management is doing my nut in here. There, should be all man needs now. Let's ignore our advice and go out there with no provisions and no backup power. I'm getting conflicting uh, information here. Fish eyeballs taste great and it's like eating massive bogeys. Bogey? Didn't realize we had four-year-olds in this channel. Anything worth scanning here? Yeah, a trash can. Y yep, it's trash. <laughs> what a black bin bag. Freaking game. 
Okay, come on. Right, talk to me. What, you don't want to get in there? Ah, here we go. Anything to loot? Of course there's something to loot. Integrating new PDA data. New blueprint acquired. Man, they weren't nearly as good as fixing stuff as I am. Cut this with a knife. You're trying to tell me what to do. Alright, what do I get there? A whole bunch of creepy vine samples. And you know what? I wouldn't mind having a bit more of these lemons. We're a tad full now though. Hmm. Oh I did I did get the thing's tooth. Excellent. Alright, well then let's head on back to base camp. How did he see that, says Jagger? I, I don't know what you mean. That seems like a way to get my mesh, though. The tooth is the one you picked up before. Okay, I wonder if I can scan that. No, I already scanned the tooth, didn't I? Alright. In we go, go. Let's see what we can do with all this junk. Gonna thwam that over there so I have plenty of those to keep me safe. Now we're talking. Fiber mesh. Although it takes two creepy vines to make one of these, so that's a bit of back and forth thing. But that does allow me to do something. Almost. I need a wiring kit. Wiring kit needs silver ore, if only somewhere I had silver ore. If only. Quartz, salt, titanium, toasters, floaters, gold. Time to check everything. Silver ore, but that's only one. I think I needed two. That's nothing but titanium. There's our other silver ore. McCain says, Happy Friday. It is, isn't it? Right. Let's make ourselves our wiring kit. Made entirely out of silver. It's a very expensive wiring kit. And now I can get my rebreather. Conserve oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles. That sounds very good. There we go. Excellent. And we still have a bit more creepy vine seed clusters. So that seems prudent to make into more of this silicon rubber. Okay. As an experienced Subnautica player, this is hard to watch, says T uh, Captain Torlek. Well, I don't know what you'd expect when watching somebody play a game that you know inside out blind. What, I meant to pick it up and instantly know all of everything? You brought the pain on yourself. Okay, what's what now? What's our next goal? We went and found the crashed out place. Is there any equipment that's a big step up for us? I already have fins. I can't imagine making another set of fins will be very helpful. Still need that radiation suit so I can handle all that, well, radiation. So let's go and grab a bit more fiber. Ooh. Grab a bit more fiber mesh. I guess I'll turn that salvage in and dump the rest of my stuff. You did get the compass blueprint, not that I saw, although I wouldn't doubt that. I have Pathfinder needs the seeds, wire and titan, I got all of that stuff. Displo uh, displays holographic pathfinding discs used to find a way back to blah 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 blah, okay. 
I don't know how to make a mobile vehicle bay, but I bet I can find the stuff for it. Same with the grav traffic. Okay. Ditch the stuff that I have. Like that fiber mesh, I guess. Should ditch as much stuff as I can right now if I'm not actively using it. So I don't want my fire extinguisher anymore. I don't seem to use my repair tool. I never seem to use flares. Uh, I'd feel uncomfortable going around without, without a knife. I'll drop my tooth just in case. And then we're going to go and pick up a load of seeds and vines and stuff. And I've forgotten which direction it was in. Probably the opposite of you, so let's go this way. You know, I take it back. This thing's pretty good. Good thing we can see those from a distance. As I said, keep the knife, get cutting. All mine. Or did I already get everything I can out of you? Uh, take one more. Oh, Christ! Right, you get away from me. Two, two, and two. So I just want a couple of these things. Really doesn't like me taking his, uh, taking his tea. Wait, what? Did I underestimate the amount of space I had? Probably. Tell you what, feels like I have a bit too much titanium to hand. Didn't I have a thing here that was purely titanium? There we go. I wonder if I could rename these so I can easily know which one has which. Although if I get that mod that allows us to fabricate straight from them, that'll be a lot easier. Right, I wanted fiber mesh. Lots of it. Can rename them, approach them from above. Thanks, monk. I've already forgotten what I was trying to do here, though. Pathfinder. Needs more of those seeds, but there was something else, wasn't there? I feel like there was something else that I wanted. No, it was probably that. Copper wire, titanium, and more of those seeds. I'll tell you what, let's make a bit more of that rubber for now. Go back and get a bunch more of those seeds and get the pathfinder. So much stuff. So much bloody stuff. Okay, okay, okay. At this rate, I think I want to make another storage thing. And then I'll have space for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And if I ditch that stuff even more. <laughs> Thing comes out and greets me every time. Right. Out you go. So if we approach from above, hey, we can edit the name. How handy. But I'd really rather not have to care about their names whatsoever. That gives us lots of space. I'll have even more if I ditch something useless like you. And let's do it. Jake, you're a true hoarder. All looks like it'll be useful. I do like digital hoarding for what it's worth. Uh, real life hoarding, though, is uh, terrible. Wait, I don't even think that's what I was wanting. I wanted those seeds, right? Yeah. Hmm. 
Always want salt. I thought I could eat those. They look edible, don't they? I want one more, so... Too bad, this'll do. We're finding a lot of stuff really close to base. I am assuming that that's going to change at some point where everything that I need to get off this planet is over at the Aurora, for example. And I'm going to need to set up remote bases. Right. Now, here we go. What is it that I need? Oh, this is what I wanted to do. So I need lead and mesh. Lead, mesh, wire, titanium. There's the mesh. Lead, wire, titanium. Lead. Uh, there's the wire, at least. Lead. Grab that in case I need more wire. More titanium. How much titanium did I need? I don't know, but I should have more there. Oh, right, Jake. Save and save often. This game does not autosave. What? Good lord. Thanks for the heads up. What if it had crashed or something? That would have been grim. Radiation suit. Don't know why it's giving me a. No, I was matching things. There we go. Radiation gloves. Lead-based radiation protection. Lead-based suit. Doesn't seem to slow me down or anything, does it? Great. And the other thing I wanted was my pathfinding tool. Very presumptuous of the game to think that that'll help me find my way around. I'm very, very bad at orienteering. But I'm sure we'll get around. And I'm still left with some creepy viney stuff. So let's make a bit of lubricant. Again, nice of it to make the bottle for me. And some more silicon. A lot more silicon. Okay, now what? Now I actually don't know. There's nothing clear that I have available here but can't make myself. Oh, perhaps. Compass actually looks incredibly useful, but I need more silver for that. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. Okay, okay, okay. Right, excellent. Here's what's going to happen. I am already 300% done with having to juggle my inventory for this fabricator. So we're going to call it here for the stream. Hopefully I can have a much longer chump at this next time, but that's going to be after I find and employ some kind of mod that stops all this faffing about because the idea of having to jump between all these inventories is a massive turn-off. Very massive turn-off. It's a real higgledy-piggledy to go between them and juggle inventories just so that I can come back to here and then go, oh, I needed one bit more titanium and go back out and in. So I'm going to go and find whatever mods it takes to make that happen. And if it can't... Uh, if it only works with this, then so be it. Maybe I'll find a mod that'll make this thing like infinitely big. Just anything to bring some quality of life to this anti-quality of life fabrication sensation. So that's how it's going to go down, and we'll be back with more of Subnautica in the next long play uh, segments, which I imagine are going to be next week, actually. Damn, where does time go? All right, cheers for joining for this. Subnautic actually looks really good, and damn, does it look really good. So we will be playing out this long play to its logical conclusion, whatever that is. I know that might be very painful for people that know and have played this game before, but too bad. Yeah, well said, gas creature. All right, until our next stream then, so cheers from me, and a cheerio.